packed inside a one-horse town with a faded welcome. There's more big tops than stoplights. Hugo, Oklahoma is one town where the circus never really leaves. It's known as Circus City, USA. The farm animals are measured in tons. Back when the circuses uh, started here, our land was cheap and they owned several hundreds of acres of land. In 1939, the Kelly Miller Circus rolled into town. Over the years, 20 other circuses have followed. A lot of times in the fall when you're when you're driving back after a long season on the road, you'll see the little signs in front of the shop saying, Welcome back, circus. Today, Hugo is the winter home for three circuses. Hugo probably accepts the circus and the circus people better than any town in the United States. Dudley Hamilton has called Hugo home every winter for 25 years. Now he manages the winter quarters while the Kelly Miller Circus is on the road. The circus uh, was good for the town and the, the town was good for the circus. I raised my children in show business and my grandchildren also were on my circus. David Rawls moved to Hugo with his parents in 1955. Circus performing is in his blood. My brother and I did a trampoline act and I was a, a Western performer. Rawls bought the Kelly Miller Circus and toured with it for 25 years. You either love it or you hate it. And if you hate it, you're not going to be here very long. Once the circus leaves Hugo for the year, the performers put on two shows a day, seven days a week. These circuses perform the old fashioned way. They still go down the highway with their trucks pulling their elephants. Once a year, the circuses set up the big top in their backyard. Lisa the elephant uh, will come in and pull up the four center pole for a special performance for their neighbors. The day begins at Angie's Circus Diner. Cash and green beans. This is where the circus people actually all come and eat whenever they're in town. You find the owners, some of the greatest circus, circus people in the United States, as eat in this diner. After breakfast, people in Hugo watch as the big top takes shape. Their little schoolmates come out here and see those kids in the circus with their costumes on and everything. And it, you know, it's a big thrill for those, for those kids. We've got uh, three elephants traveling with us and doing performing. Along with five tigers. Camels performing horses, aerialists, acrobats, clowns, jugglers, all the mix that makes the circus such a great entertainment. We always get a big crowd in Hugo, and this is home. The duo with the permanent smiles works hard for laughs. I wanted to be a clown with the circus since I was four years old. So. Yeah, me too. Since he was four years old, I wanted to be a clown with the circus. Direct from Queensland, Australia, the extreme aerial artistry of Nikita. A long way from home, Nikita found herself performing on the trapeze in Hugo. It's nice to come to a circus that actually has a winter quarters and has a has a home. Nikita feels most at home at the top of the tent. Just me up there swinging away on the trapeze. You sit down and you watch a two hour performance under the big top of things that you won't get an opportunity to see very often in your lifetime. At the end of the day, when the smiles fade. They're all show people and that's, that's the number one rule. And the circus leaves town. I tell people this is the happiest cemetery in the in the United States. The performers rest. Some of those people do do not have families and they like to be buried here among their friends. Their first permanent homes are as elaborate as their lives. It sort of depicts the nature of, of certain people. You know they their their life is is in the circus and they're always sort of showy and flashy. And while he's not planning on moving in anytime soon, Dudley has already built his permanent home in Hugo. But you have to do it by dying. <laughs> he's leaving a blessing. May all your days be circus days. Circus day for children is always a big, big happy day off, you know. So I put that on my stone. Because in Hugo, Oklahoma, every day is a circus day.